Welcome to Wolf Chevrolet. Today we're taking a closer look at some of the interior and exterior features in our 2017 Chevrolet Silverado. The Silverado is featured in the high country trim and has an iridescent pearl tri-coat paint finish. It includes features such as heated and vented front seats, heated steering wheel, backup camera with adaptive and hitch guidelines, chrome assist steps, a powered sunroof, GPS navigation, and much more. Starting off in the front of the vehicle, you can see above our chrome finished door handle, we have our driver's seat memory. Below, we have power folding mirrors, power locks, power windows, as well as our child safety and rear window lock. The rest of the door has some additional storage, as well as our Bose speaker. Inside the vehicle, to the left of the steering wheel, we have all of our controls for our trailer brake controller, transfer case settings, as well as all of our lighting controls. Powered settings down the side of our driver's seat, which is finished in our saddle leather. You can see our high country trim on the headrest. Getting into the vehicle and looking above our steering wheel, we can see our display cluster. In the center, we have a digital information system. Moving down to the left-hand side of the steering wheel, we have our cruise settings, forward collision alert, and heated steering wheel button. On the right-hand side, we have our hands-free, as well as all the controls for our driver information system. Hazard lights were on top of our steering column. Moving to the middle, we can see our infotainment system, AM, FM, Sirius XM, Bluetooth audio. Also have our phone connection, phone projection. We can see a CD MP3 player in the bottom. GPS navigation. Swiping to the right, we can also see apps as well as my Chevrolet. Putting the vehicle in reverse, we have a backup camera with adaptive guidelines. It is a touch screen if we don't want to use the touch controls, however, we have some additional controls across the bottom, including our volume and menu controls. Then we have our dual zone climate control with our heated and vented driver and passenger seat on either side. Across the bottom, we have our power adjustable pedals, traction control, high, bed, high beam lighting, as well as our parking sensors and lane keep assist. Then we have our power accessible in the front of the vehicle. From left to right, we have two USBs, two 12 volts, and a 120 volt plug. Then we have some storage behind that, two cup holders, center console, also finished in our saddle leather, with a wireless charging pad up top. Inside, we have some more deep storage, 12 volt plug on the driver's side, shallow storage in the front, as well as two USBs and a 12 auxiliary input on the passenger side. Passenger seat also finished in our saddle leather with our high country trim. Moving above the rear view mirror, we have all of our dome lighting controls, universal garage door opener, controls for our tilt sliding power sunroof, power sliding third rear window controls, lighting controls for if we want to turn them on when the door is open or not, a sunglass holder, and lastly, our sunroof in the front of the vehicle. Now walking down the side of the vehicle, moving to our front tire and rim, we have a chromed aluminum rim with our Chevrolet bow tie center cap and an all-terrain tire. Moving out, we have a chrome capped mirrors as well as chrome capped door handles and a chrome assist step across the bottom. At the back, we have chrome cross rails, our corner bumper steps. Moving all the way around to the back, we can see our Silverado and High Country badging in chrome. Our black Chevrolet bow tie. We have a trailer hitch on the bottom. Backup camera on the bottom of our handle. Opening into the rear of the truck. Cable tie downs in the front and back, as well as our lined bed. Moving into the back of the vehicle, we have a chrome finished door handle. Power window control, as well as storage throughout, and our Bose speaker. Inside the vehicle, we have storage pockets in the back of the driver and passenger seat. Between the two front seats, we have some storage as well as a 12 volt plug. Moving to these seats in the second row, we have three of them, all finished in our saddle leather. In the center seat, we have two foldable cup holders. Behind it, a power sliding third rear window. Lastly, we can lift up all three seats in the back by simply lifting up on the bottom to make some additional storage space. Thank you for joining me for this quick video walk around of the 2017 Chevrolet Silverado. 
If you enjoyed, please be sure to subscribe for more daily videos, and we hope to see you at Wolf Chevrolet soon.